three scientists have been awarded the 2020 Nobel Prize in Physics for work to understand black holes. Roger Penrose, Reinhard Genzel, and Andrea Ghez were announced as this year's winners at a news conference in Stockholm. The winners will share the prize money of 10 million kronor, 864,200. Swedish industrialist and chemist Alfred Nobel founded the prizes in his will, written in 1895 a year before his death. David Haviland, chair of the Physics Prize Committee, said this year's award celebrates one of the most exotic objects in the universe. Black holes are regions of space where gravity is so strong that not even light can escape from them. UK-born physicist Sir Roger Penrose from the University of Oxford demonstrated that black holes were an inevitable consequence of Albert Einstein's theory of general relativity. The history of black holes goes way back in time to the end of the 18th century. Then, through Einstein's general relativity, we had the tools to describe these objects for real, said Ulf Danielson, a member of the Nobel Committee. But the mathematics of these objects was incredibly complicated to understand, and many researchers believe they were nothing more than mathematical artifacts that existed on paper alone. It took researchers several decades to realize that they could exist in the real world. That's what Roger Penrose did, said Danielson. He understood the mathematics, he introduced new tools, and then could actually prove that this is a process you can naturally expect to happen that a star collapses and turns into a black hole. Sir Roger, he said, laid the theoretical foundations to say these objects exist. You can expect to find them if you go out and look for them. Reinhard Genzel and Andrea Ghez provided the most convincing evidence yet of a supermassive black hole at the center of our galaxy the Milky Way. They found that this huge object, known as Sagittarius A, was tugging on the jumble of stars orbiting it. American Prof Ghez from the University of California, Los Angeles, UCLA, said. I'm thrilled to receive the prize and I take very seriously the responsibility of being the fourth woman to win the Nobel Prize in Physics. Reinhard Genzel from the Max Planck Institute for Extraterrestrial Physics in Garching, Germany. And Gez used the world's largest telescopes to see through huge clouds of interstellar gas to the center of the Milky Way. Their discovery stretched the limits of technology, and they had to develop new techniques to compensate for distortions to their observations caused by the Earth's atmosphere.